Yo, what's good, everybody, man? It's your boy, Kobe, and uh, Mick. Jeez, today, yo, we got Arizona. That is ranked 21 going against Colorado in Colorado tonight, man. You know I always got to support the guy, Deion Sanders, man. He has done a lot for this football program. They did have a winning season at the beginning of the year of setting TCU and a couple of other teams, but they got beat by teams that we knew they was going to lose to, a team being USC, a team being Oregon. It's tough out there in the Pac-12. I can't even lie to y'all boys, man. But for any videos you guys want to see me doing in the near future, all you guys have to do is comment down below or hit me on my Twitter or Instagram, at Kobe in the Mix. And with all that being said, y'all, fall for their ado. Let's do what they do and get right into the motherfucking video. Let's get it. Let's go. We got a whole bunch of videos that we are doing today. No bad. I know you guys can hear the volume. You know, so. About that. It's about to be on in three, two, one. Here we go. Man, already fumbling. We got Colorado, that's four and five. We got Arizona, that's six and three. Woo! Make sure the volume isn't too loud. Oh, I thought that dude was sleeping. <laughs> Let's see it. Shador Sanders is going to scramble his way into the end zone. Touchdown, Colorado. Yep, that's a celebration. You know, with the watch. <laughs> Deion Sanders with the first touchdown. <laughs> Deion Sanders signed with the first touchdown for Colorado. Seeing a hole up the middle. Hit him with a left, hit him with a right. Back into the middle for a touchdown, man. Stop playing with this boy, man. But yeah, um, the Colorado, uh, forgot what their uh, team name is. But Colorado, man, uh, they're in rebuild mode right now. So I did not really expect them to go far this year, man. I know the Pac-12 is very, very hard, y'all, but... It's going to be in a matter of time, but I think the scene is going to be competing with some of the top teams like USC, Oregon, and so forth, bro. But you got to think, too, with those USC players in Oregon, they've been playing with each other for a while, bro. Pause. So they got a lot more chemistry than this Colorado team does. But Arizona just scored on this drive to tie the ball game up to 7-7. Seven to seven. But yeah, man, I'm I'm real proud with Deion Sanders did with this organization. You, know? you got to think he came from an HBCU, Jackson State, and his team only had lost one game, y'all. I believe they only lost one game. I think it was one game in the season, and it was the championship game. Unless the only game they lost was in the championship game. But yeah, he did a lot for that HBCU. And they said, hey, look here, man, you want to be a college head coach? We'll pay you more. Hey. You got to take that opportunity. To the nice. Damn. Jimmy Horn. Okay. Everybody going wild. It's a packed stadium out there tonight in Colorado. They out here playing some football. Got to love it. Right over the defender's head. On his head, top. 14 to 7. Damn, good run. Good run. Good ass run. 30. Inside the 20. Outside the 10. Broke the tackle. Good field position. Screen play on the right hand side. Good blocks. Not in inside the 10. That's red zone territory right there. Can they make something happen in the red zone territory? Can this be a scoring drive for Arizona? Yes, it can. Yes, it can. Jacob Cowing. Well, that's a, it's good. Honestly, that's a giveaway by Colorado. A needless yeah. penalty. Well, I love the design, Ted. They've run this a few times the last Ooh. few weeks with Jacob Cowing in terms of the motion. Colorado, the line they need to get the four. Tied 14 14 right now. Let's get it, Colorado. Let's get it. Make some noise. Just at this point, we want to see how they compete against all the other teams that they got left in the Pac-12. But yeah, big matchups like Arizona, Oregon, USC. They got to prepare for this stuff every single year. Now, I don't know what college football. That's another touchdown. Is that a touchdown? But yeah, I don't know what college football, if you got to play all four years or if you can be one and done. I'm not sure. 
I'm pretty sure you can just play, um, I don't know if it's three years, two years, or one year, or you got to play all four years, but uh, comment down below if you guys know that. Uh, matter of fact, I can just look it up. Me being lazy. He got it right here. In order to be eligible to enter the NFL draft, the prospect must have been three years removed from high school and have used their college eligibility prior to start of the next college football season. Underclassmen and players that graduate. So I think they got to play for like three years, bro. You got to play at least three years in college. Touchdown for Colorado. So they did not rule that a touchdown, but they was at the one yard line and they fed the running back. Deion Sanders, man. With all that bling going. Looking so fresh and so clean, clean. Boy got that ice up. Damn. That's gonna hurt though. Hey, they doing good so far. They up against Arizona. 21 to 14. They are gonna fall short. But this might go. Yes, it will. 21-17, four-point game. Damn, he hurt his knee. Set up in the shotgun, Shador Sanders. He's going to... Travis Hunter, the two-way star with the catch by Shador Sanders. Mm-mm-mm. 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 Damn. That was at third and 20. Damn. 39 yards. Oh, and that is good. 24 to 17. Now they up a whole touchdown, though. They are up by a whole touchdown. They up by seven. Mm. Mm. That boy moving. That boy is fucking moving. Travis Hunter took him down. Yeah. That boy was moving, moving. Ooh, you got to feed him again. Damn, they ain't going to feed him again. Nice with the one hand snag. Okay. Okay. Tie ball game. The one hand snagger. Caught that bit. He's like, Woo That was clean. 24-24. Third quarter. Hey. Hey. Fourth and seven. Colorado's going with it. They going for it. Very interesting. Oh, he's gone. He's gone. Turning on the Jets for that Colorado first down. Their drive will continue. Good blocks, bro, by Colorado. The whole line is doing a lot better than what they was the last time I reacted to him. Shador Sanders kept getting hit over and over and over again. Line is looking a little bit better for Colorado. Definitely made some improvements. That boy Shador Sanders, he did not have no protection. Nice. That's 31 to 24. Watch your tight end, 87. You'll see it happen. It'll end up right there. He's going to start on this side with the motion. He sneaks all the way across the other side. Yeah, that motion distracted the ass. Yeah, two receivers open on that. Mmm. That was one hell of a catch. Yeah. Inside the 20. 31 to 24. Hey, Colorado is out here, though. Colorado is out here giving Arizona a fight. They're not making it easy, but Arizona is going to get a touchdown again with a tie ball game. 31-31 in the Pac-12 division in Colorado tonight. Like I said, we got a lot of games that we are doing today, man. So stay tuned and hit that notification bell. We are about to be reacting to games today. 
Got a couple of games I'm going to try to react to. Nice. He's gone. Turning on the Jets. Say goodbye. <laughs> Go ahead. Go ahead. Oh. He thought he was going to get that opening for that first down, but he got clothesline. He got clothesline. Damn, he missed it? Bro, you got to hit stuff like that. Yeah, I think it's the Colorado Buffaloes. I think that's their team name, the Buffalo. Don't let them get in field goal territory or it's too late, nah. Yeah. Colorado only got two timeouts left. Arizona only got two timeouts left. You already know they're going to try to clock it. They're about to try to clock it. Colorado had to use one timeout. They got to get the stop, and they could not get the stop. Oh, they waste the clock now. Good. It don't even matter if it's a touchdown or not. They ain't going to go for it. They about to milk it. Yeah, they clocking this shit. <laughs> they clocked the hell out of that. Colorado pissed, but Arizona got the dub. Yeah, that was a good-ass game, though, man. That was a great-ass game, bro. Damn. It came close, though. They almost won, bro. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed. We got more games on the way. And with all that being said, man, it's your boy Kobe. And I'm going to see y'all boys in the next one. Peace. Cheers.